Good afternoon, Como visitors. Welcome to Seal Island. My name is Melissa. I'm a public educator at the zoo. Today I'm going to talk to oh you about God. harbor seals and the zoo's training program that we do with the animals. So here in Seal Island, we have two harbor seals. They both came to it. us from rehabilitation centers where they were oh actually God. deemed unreleasable by the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service. We have Ginger and Fletcher. So Ginger, she is 13 years old and about 110 pounds, and she was actually found stranded on the shores of Maine. Fletcher, he is about 90 pounds and five years old, and he came to us from a center in California. Now, unfortunately, when Fletcher was just days old, he was in a storm, and he was separated from his mom. He did sustain injuries to both of his eyes. The center was able to save partial vision in one eye, but not the other. And also, Fletcher just doesn't have the same instinct to eat like other animals do because he was separated from his mom when he was so young. So you might notice during some training that he's less food motivated and more tactile or touch motivated. But the zookeepers do feed during that as well. Uh, the zookeepers have tried many different techniques with uh, Fletcher. They've also <laughs> contacted many facilities and done many Whoa! things to improve his I didn't know we can do that. But this is just one reason <laughs> I don't all work at the zoo will receive an animal from a rehabilitation center. All right, I'm gonna start talking about training here just because the zookeepers are out already. Uh, so a lot of people think we do training uh, to for fancy behaviors like seen at our Sparky the Sea Lion show. And that's not why we do training actually. We do it for a number of other reasons. It does provide mental stimulation for the animals. The zookeepers mm -hmm. actually do train the seals three times a day. Oh, so clapping! school every single day. They don't get a summer break like you guys do. Also, training helps provide um, a nice clear Look, form of communication between like the zookeepers and the seals. So let's say the zookeepers <laughs> need to transport the seals off the island back to the aquatics building. Well, they can, can roll. Them, they can ask them to go into a Ow. crate voluntarily so they can see if we'll go Ooh, got a big one now. That's a bye bye. The it last one, that's right. The more the loop or anything, the last one, no? The primary reason we do training here at the zoo for animals is for husbandry purposes, which means the health care of the animals. But where are they going?